Hello, I am Dr. Jackson Jewett, also known as Dr. J. I currently serve as the Director of Veterinary Care and Attending Veterinarian here at Chimp Haven. So I am lucky enough to tell you uh, what one of our models is here at Chimp Haven, and it's that we're not that different. But there are some key differences, and I have some cute little um, skeletons here to help me to teach you along the way. So this is a chimpanzee skeleton, and this here is a human skeleton. And we're gonna talk about what makes us so different in areas where we are the same. All right, so I'm going to start with our chimpanzee skeleton. This is known as the thorax. The chimpanzee actually has one more thoracic vertebrae than we have here in the human. They also have, this is known as the lumbar vertebrae, they actually have one less. And why do we think that that is? I think it's because of how we get around. And that is what they have proven. Because chimpanzees, what we see them down on all fours. Humans, we walk bipedally. That means we're on two legs here. And so there were some changes to the vertebrae to accommodate for that. One other key difference that you can notice is the chin area here. So this is protruding a little more than what you see in the human. Another key difference, and probably something that I struggle with as a veterinarian, are these canines. We both have canines, but the chimps, as you can see, are much larger, which makes those really hard to get out whenever there needs to be an extraction. Uh, another key thing that I thought was pretty interesting is the largest bone in each body. So in the chimpanzee, the largest bone is the humerus. That's here in the arm. And in the human, it is the femur. It's in the leg. Again, really because of how we get around. Chimpanzees also have longer fingers and shorter thumbs. And that's for them to be able to brachiate through trees, climb trees, and to get away. Whereas us as humans, we use our legs. So the largest bone is, is the femur. And we have smaller bones in the hands and a, long, a longer thumb. So we've talked about some of the key differences in the chimpanzee and the human, but there are so many other similarities. One of which is the size of the brain or the cranial area. And so because of that, great apes have large brains just like we do as humans. And that means that we can develop some of the same relationships with others just like they do in their social groups. We also determine what our likes and dislikes are. Overall, the chimpanzee and the human are surprisingly similar. And that allows us to know exactly how to provide the best care for them here at Chimp Haven.